Mayfield marks the spot. It's the halfway point between Traverse City and Kingsley and just might come with some real hunger if you're a little road weary. Charlie Tinker has a sure cure for that hunger inside the kitchen. We're here at the Mayfield Country Store. You uh, can not only take your pick of the menu, which is pretty expansive, and I'm, I'm told that if they have the ingredients, they're going to make it for you. But you're going to get a real feeling of the community it belongs to, Mayfield. I'm Charlie Tinker in Mayfield, uh, a really charming little community uh, with a real hidden gem in this country store, a bona fide general store that practically no longer exists, and man, the food you can get here. We're going to go inside the kitchen to see how they're doing it. If I had a dollar for every time somebody said this is just such a great place, <laughs> I could retire probably, but I'm not ready to do that yet. Your mother likely warned you not to judge a book by its cover. In Mayfield, you'll find hard evidence she was right. From the sear on a half pounder to attaining pizza perfection, pepperoni by pepperoni, then sweetening the deal. This is all about garlic. We do garlic crust on all of our pizzas. That pizza that comes out of here is pretty good, from uh, just a pepperoni pizza up to a chicken bacon ranch to a uh, barbecue chicken pizza, buffalo chicken pizza. We have pretty much anything, Reuben pizza. So it's kind of a specialty type thing, you know. They can come in and build their own sandwiches. We have wraps that we do. Green olives. Amazingly, the entirety of the spread produced in the nondescript Northern Lodge, which houses Mayfield Country Store, even what you'll find in the case, is executed with a sense of pride. The menu reads like a global grub encyclopedia, and everyone here has a specialty, meaning you can order everything from a wet burrito to an overstuffed Italian with complete confidence. Just a little drizzle of that, voila, and there is your sandwich. The people traveling through stop and just kind of come in and say, wow, this is really cool, you know? I mean, we got good music playing, you know, they can come in, grab breakfast. They get pretty spoiled, to tell you the truth. Beyond sating your hunger, come for a true sense of the charming community you're passing through. I got great people. When you walk in the door, somebody says hi to you and they acknowledge who you are. We try and uh, keep everything sparkling, shiny, clean, and I think it speaks for itself. Reflected, too, in the people who have made it part of their lives. They come in here, grab a bite to eat. Um, we get a morning coffee club with a bunch of older gentlemen that like to come in here and tell stories and drink coffee and maybe a few lies once in a while. It's just a place to, to feel at home, you know. This is, this is home. Inside the kitchen, I'm Charlie Tinker.